The confirmation of the first case of COVID-19 in Kenya Friday has seemingly put the country on high alert as the executive and other arms of government join in taking precautionary measures to forestall the spread of the deadly COVID-19 virus. Taking the cue from the Health Cabinet Secretary Mutahi Kagwe, who among other measures suspended prison visits for the next 30 days, the judiciary would also take a collective stand in securing players in the entire justice system. In compliance with the directive issued by the National Emergency and Response Committee, we shall forthwith scale down court activities throughout the country for a period of two weeks starting tomorrow the 16th of March. Chief Justice David Maraga also stating that all cases except serious ones will be dealt with at police stations in line with guidelines to be issued by the Inspector General of Police. Hearings and missions of all civil cases in all the courts are hereby suspended with the immediate effect. During this time, however, all judicial officers will remain at their duty stations, though there will be no open court appearances. The National Council on Administration of Justice will review these directions from time to time as need arises. All conferences, trainings and workshops have also been suspended, with all foreign travel for staff suspended for the next 30 days, save for exceptional circumstances. The National Council on Administration of Justice will, however, review these recommendations from time to time and as need arises. Caroline Kamar reporting for Channel 1 News.